All right, what's up, Clash? As y'all can see, Charles with the most Paul can too. Back, back with a brand new trip to the thrift. We're outside of the Goodwin Williams Jr. I just took um, my gal friend some lunch to work because she woke up hella late, and you know I come with the sauce. That's too much sauce. Five ketchup packets definitely is enough sustenance to get through an entire workday. Shout out to everyone that follows me on Instagram. Either way, y'all don't know probably what I'm talking about, but yeah, I figure while I'm in the area, I'll go to some other thrift stores, hence why we're shooting on my phone. phone but let's get it. If y'all want to buy gear, thriftadvantage.com. I'm just saying that right now so you guys don't forget. Let's get in this bit. All right, y'all, we're in here, man. Big Goodwill camping. Oh my God, dude. They just have this banger of a hat. I just found this. <laughs> Straight up, man. What you doing? This hat was just chilling. Ooh heavily heavily infused with some uh some working man sweat right there hey then you also have some identified some unidentified substance on this vintage bike jacket and then check out this cut and sew nautica man oh uh, yes nice little corduroy textures that's like speed bumps for ants what is this a center for ants and this thing is cut and sewed all the way up it got like a picnic blanket on the back side some nice little white sleeves fit oh this is crazy this is crazy they got a framed black and white sheep unification tile right here hell yeah bro but this banger right here speaking of animals check it out you got mini mouse on the front side showing naked rat ass on the back side. i actually know she she pantied up with the little hole for the tech oh that's convenient Oh, my size? The very convenient CCM foot weapons? We blade it up. Dude, check it out. You got a whole forest in the thrift, man. You can just be a floating a floating head and some legs. No torso at all. But why are they all double stitched all the way up? Oh, yes. This is what I needed in my life. Look at that. Single on the stitching. Are my nails like... Oh, yeah. I ate a mango this morning. That's mango residue on my thumb. Anyways, guys, you have that Anodarko. Anadarko, real tree camo, oh, three, high yeah. peak, single stitch T. Why is it sick? Oh, y'all see it, man. That's what I love. That's what I love to see. That's three quarter leg coverage in the form of some shorts. Hold on. What y'all doing, hangers? Oh, the Tommy for your mommy. Burlap sack, brown light tan. George for men size 32. Hey, these will actually fit me flawlessly, bruh. Look at that. Oh, okay. Oh my lord. My brain is literally about to break. Oh my god. This is like Marcel our friends. All distinguished though. This is like his ancestors. Oh. Why are they charging $20 for this, man? Goodwill can't even let me buy like ironic gifts. Trippy. My size? That football shaped queso cauldron? Hey, I'm gonna use that on Super Bowl Sunday. What you think? Put some bean dip, put some queso in there. In that big thing? Yeah, some Velveeta. Are no, you man. expecting 100 people at your place? Nah, probably just like eight. That's gonna be more than. But if I put all the chips in the bottom of it, and then just, okay, or bean, oh, how, about, how about this? Beans on the bottom. Like seven layer uh, taco salad, but like predominantly chips. How much that is, is that? Take a lot. I feel that up. Hey, everything is bigger and better in Texas, baby. Yeah, I don't know about that. Only six dollars, yeah. and it has the ventilation. Mm -hmm. This is for this is for chips, right? What like queso. You What's it I, for? You know what I would do? Y'all gonna have beer? I put ice in it and put the beer in it. Oh, that's a good idea, too. That's what I would and, do. And the guac, that. like have ice in the bottom, a little bowl of guac and beer. Yeah, that'd be fire. Where's this party? <laughs> hey, you trying to come through? I'll send the address. <laughs> you put on the makeup. All right, guys. Yeah, we're out of there, man. Um, shout out the Goodwill employee, though. Super cool. She actually was trying to reason with me about not purchasing the giant football to fill with queso. She was like, you could put beer in it and like have it filled with ice. I was like, man, I'm not about to buy this. But it was so cute. She was trying to help me and was definitely 
advising against filling that with Velveeta cheese. So she's really looking out for my health and health is wealth. So I'm rich. All right, guys, we've arrived at the next thrift store. Let's see what's going on up in here. I am like a little fortune cookie. I'll fold it up and delicious. This is a smaller thrift store, so I don't have too much stuff. There is some insane taxation without representation, but this isn't a chain store. It's like a local spot, so I'm not gonna roast them. But check out the three things that I did scoop. Guys, sweater season. Look at this, it's like an ugly Christmas sweater, except for Halloween, bruh, it's hella clean. <laughs> Check it out, you have a cat on a jack-o'-lantern. You can wear this any time of the year, though, when it's not like 90 degrees outside. Like, completely hand-knitted in Granny's Craft Cove. This is nuts, man. Heirloom collectibles. It's like $4, and you have this little nice pebble beach, all embroidered crew neck, and then this kooji esque with the all rumple stiltskin, spinning wheel gold trimmings. Wow. Oh my goodness, man. That nice silvery gold two-piece tracksuit by Cabin Creek. Oh, there's a lady at my church growing up that would rock nothing but the 90s tracksuits. Good Lord, so wet. Sweat. Guys, am I tripping? I feel like this hat is hella cool. It has jets embroidered all over it. I mean, it's kind of simple on the other side. It's like an air, air show participation trophy strap back. Nice. But this thing is hella cool. Jet it up. Don't miss this jet ho. Don't miss this jet ho. Don't miss this jet ho. All right, guys, here we go. Next spot of the day, of course, the Salvation Army. Let's get in there and hopefully find a few enticing items. All right, guys, big blessings. We're in here in the crew neck department. I told y'all last video, Cantu, the crew neck king. We're banging them out, baby. Paul plan to in this thing. I do have a little gardening channel. Link in the description if you guys want to check that out. But look at this. It's like floral fuego all over print. I don't know, like third grade art project. Like this is looking wild, abstract, obtuse, but I think it's cool enough to grab. But that is just a little appetizer because you have the sunflower double neck crew neck. All right, look at this guy. Pollination station. Dude, the seeds are just blowing off in the wind. This piece goes crazy. And then, you know, you got that Acapulco gold. Bro. Pilot, got the snorkel, little mouth feature. That's nice, that's real nice. Uh-oh, something else is hiding in the ladies section, that champion, peach, Syracuse, eco-friendly sweater. Oh man, oh, I'll throw this on and look like a Cheeto puff. Oh my Lord, these are some Koparuskis right here. This graphic is swag-tastic, huh? You got the Shaker Heights, physical ed. Boy, getting swole. All these dudes have the nice Simpsons yellow skin tone. John did. Oh my lord. The short section is banging. Spring is right around the corner. Look at the print on this guy. And then you kind of have the African inspired Jamaican, maybe Maryland with some green color scheme. Dude, price? Seven. Seven. Dude, look at this. The sky is peeking out. It's shining upon my spirit because we got some things in the Salvation Army. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, guys, we're picking up another day, another dollar. There is an estate sale right around yonder. I'm still shooting on my phone just to keep everything uh, congruent in terms of video quality. Let's go in here and fingers crossed they have some things. The pictures look super lame, but you never know. So let's go. Oh man, we stepped in and in this like kid slash men's clothes room, there are some things, dude. Holy moly, dude, check these out. So I saw these hanging on this door when I walked in. They have the Notre Dame, all oh. golden, starter that goes harder. Look at the insignia. Oh my God, but they're charging 20. Yes. Oh man, that hurts my soul. There's the flamingo encrusted button up. Beautiful, Brett Favre, logo athletic. Kind of chipped up, but still is absolutely delightful. Big last name. And then you have wait, no, wait. the champion, beautiful grape color scheme, size 48. That's like a large slash XL, bruh. 
Mr. Tony Robinson, that's, that's not his name. David Robinson, that's not his name. Glenn Robinson. Back for Robinson, has a good look at it, puts it in. I love the colors. And then the OJ Simpson hitter gloves. I'll stop it. All right, then last but certainly not least, you got the flick of the wand, the flick of the wrist, Orlando Magic 15. Wait, no wait, boy. All right, this is really cool. I came on this porch and <laughs> I walked outside on the porch and there's this suitcase that is full of little kids clothes and some of them are absolutely fire. Dude, check out this little guy right here. You got Big Snoop just slugging it out right here. You have this guy hitting that jumper. This kid does not look athletic. Hey, it is what it is. I don't even know how old some of these garments are, but I need to find a couple that are uh, that are grayalicious. And these were just chilling outside, man. There has to be some banger. Oh Lord, look at these shorts. Look at these, is this a skirt? Bro, wait, hold on. I'm confused. Oh my God. These are like shorts, little kid shorts. Bruh, I'm going in. I'm going in. All right, I'm bewildered, man. There's a closet with more kids clothes and they have this super old Return of the Jedi single Stiach tee. Obviously all this is my size. The Houston Oilers yellow sleeve tee, man of steel Superman like towel texture. And then a couple little pairs of shorts, the two seagulls and the GI Joe. This is absolutely a huge lick <laughs> if I was like toddler size, man. I'm still gonna get all these things for my future accident, but uh, these are absolutely amazing finds. All right, guys, we're out of there, man. Look at this, big old trash bag. Got little kid clothes. We got adult size clothes, hella clothes, man. Um, I'm really excited about the champion jerseys and obviously that Notre Dame piece was nutty if you guys want anything thrifttypeofvintage.com baby that's the website hella drops hella gear y'all know what it is man and all right to you guys we're back home right now and i just want to inform all you citizens that look at this utter chaos man there's like four foot piles of clothes that are about to hit the website thrift type of vintage and um this glenn robinson jersey hold on let me try and display it that looks horrible I don't know what's going on. Whatever, dude. Sometimes you try, sometimes you fail. But yeah, the Glenn Robinson is live on the website, thrifttypeofvintage.com, as are a couple of the polos and a ton of other gear, man. I'm doing drops almost every day because I need to get rid of these piles of clothes. So you guys, follow the Thrift Type on Instagram if y'all wanna buy any clothes. If not, it's cool, it's whatever. Today's video has been a snafu of an adventure, a lot of piecemeal compilation of thrift slash estate sale find so hopefully you guys did enjoy this little vid even though it was in in low iphone 12 quality you dig but i love y'all like my kids if you want a father i am looking to adopt let me know and i'll catch y'all next time i'm locked i'm loaded and i'm out peace killing these songs leaving a bloody life i roost and i'm in it to win it so i'm somebody that you should get used to